Welcome to the Dazwa Beats channel. Today what we're doing, I'm showing you how to install the native instruments sounds inside your MPC and inside the MPC software, all right? So this right here is the easiest way to do it that I know, all right? So I'm showing you the way that I do it, all right? So let's go, let's get it. Easiest way to get there, go to Native Instruments website. It takes you right here. You go to Music creation right here then you go to sounds if you don't see what you want right here change this right here to most recent there go to duet there go to luxa all right already purchased this now i'm gonna purchase this one so we'll come here 29 buy now Add to cart. Once we add it to the cart, right? Go to checkout. Select your billing address. Continue. Hit the I accept. I accept. Continue. And then you use whatever form and method you want to pay for it with. All right. So now you see. It says thanks for your order. Purchased it. Now, what do you do? How do you get it? How do you get it into your MPC? This way, I'm showing you how to do it now. The simplest way, the easiest way, I know how to do it. So once you purchase it, they will send you an email with a serial number and everything. It should be in your email. Have to be in your email, right? Once it's in your email, then you're going to open up your In Music account, right? Once you open up your In Music account. All right, y'all. When you hear me say the In Music account, Open up your InMusic account. I'm talking about the InMusic Software Center, which is installed on your either PC or on your Mac. So I was saying InMusic account. I'm talking about the InMusic Software Center that you open up. Once you open up your InMusic account, see I already have the duets. The Lux is not there, right? So you'll come here to add a product. If it's a hardware you're, in, you're, you're buying, say the new MPC3 that's coming out, this is a way to register it right here too. You can do it with the hardware or you can do it with the software. I'm installing the software, right? So I'll come to software. Once I'm in software, that serial number that I said that you should get from your email would be right here. I'm going to pause the video right now and I'm going to put my serial number in and I'm going to activate it. All right, I'm going to my email. It takes a minute before Native Instruments send you the actual serial number. So the payment and everything have to go through the process and then they will send it to you. All right. So first you will get the thank you email. And then after the thank you email, you should receive a, um, another email with the confirmate with the serial number. So that's what I'm waiting on right now. All right. Look like it just came over. Just came over. So I'm going to uh, copy it. Once you hit there, you hit uh, control. Um, on the Mac is command V. On the PC is control V. All right. So then you will hit add. Once you hit add, it says it right here. Register successfully. All right. Then I'll hit continue. Once I hit continue, now it should be inside of your in music software uh, manager right here. Here, go right here. What you can do is just come right here and hit activate. Don't hit get. Just hit activate, right? This is inside the software right now. We're doing inside the software first. Hit these three, di three dashes and then hit activate right now it's activated so what you want to do now is open up the mpc software once it's there open up the mpc software now we're inside the mpc software what you want to do is go to here the hamburger menu go to not the hamburger menu i'm sorry on the mac you have to go to the mpc and then go to settings on a pc you'll go to the hamburger menu and then your preference right you'll go to activation once you go to activation you'll stroll and you try to find it wherever it is at right here 
here it go right here all you need to do is download it right here let it download they go to check mark right there right so now what we want to do is just hit OK and we can use it now go to the MPC plugins native instruments and here go right here all right so that's how you install it inside of the MPC software and inside your in music account once it's inside your in music account now once you go in standalone let's switch over to standalone let's go all right now we're inside the MPC standalone all right so now we're inside the MPC standalone what you want to do is go to menu go to preference once you're in preference go to activation and there they go right there. All you have to do is hit activate. I don't want to activate it inside here. I'll put it inside my um, MPC key 37 because I use that mostly in standalone. I use this mostly with the software. So I'm not going to install it in here because you only get, I think it's like two or three device that you can put it in. All right. So I'm not putting it in here in standalone mode. I already have it in here in... Um, in controller mode all right so that's it y'all that's all simple easy if you miss something just rewind the video get it back man watch it again let's go let's get it Tony up let's go